Hello, Aries. Welcome to your reading. So, Aries, this is whatever comes out for you guys, what your ancestors and spirit guides would like you to know. All right, Aries. So, let's see. We have Awaken and Transform. So, some of you guys are transforming. Aries, keep in mind, this is not a personal reading. These messages may resonate with you or someone you may know. So, one of you guys are transforming. You guys are going through some sort of awakening, okay, a spiritual awakening. You will be having karmic justice at tight. Yeah, so you guys are going through some sort of transformation in your life. You're having awakening, and you're going to get karmic justice, okay? So, you guys need to sit tight. So, someone is going to get karmic justice. So, if you called someone to have, if someone did you wrong in your life, and you've been praying to God for someone to get their karmic justice. Uh, it's coming, okay? So sit tight. Someone will be... Uh, we have investigation wanted to come out. So this can involve an investigation. Um, Aries, someone could be being investigated, okay? So twin flame chaser. You guys could be dealing with a twin flame chaser playing the cat and mouse game. So someone's always chasing you and maybe you're the runner and you run away or vice versa. So you get how it resonates. Um, yeah. So if you, someone did you guys wrong, we have light skin tone out here. Could be dealing with someone who is light skin tone. Um, if someone did you guys wrong, you guys called judgment. The, the universe heard and they're going to be you know, on that person now. So you guys will be getting your justice. All right, Aries. So let's see. We have this person will leave you in regret. Yeah, a person with light skin tone could leave you in regret. So you could be dealing with a person that you called judgment on, that you were asking for judgment to happen to that person. And yeah, this person could have be a drunk as well. Um, we have gift of love is coming to you guys. So you guys have a gift of love coming. This person could be investigated maybe for drunk driving. So, yeah. So we have perfect person wants to marry you to use you somehow. So there's a person that wants to come in and you use you guys somehow. Now this could be your twin flame chaser. They could try to come in and use you guys for something that you have. Um, if there's, you know, it could be finances, a place to live, a car, or just your love, your energy. You have to go through these karmic lessons to get to the next stage. So some of you guys are asking yourselves why you're going through all this, you know, mess. Um, you have to go through these karmic lessons or cross watcher for Aries. This is you. You have to go through these karmic lessons. It's going to help awaken you and transform you and take you into the next stage in your life. Okay. So, you know, sometimes you have to go through these lessons, guys. So we have work clothes. You could be in your work clothes or you're dealing with a person that's always in their work clothes. A gift of love coming to you. You could meet this person while they're in their their work clothes. Uh, she wants a family with you. So there's a woman out here that's wanting a family with you, Aries now. Or cross watcher. You could be cross watching for Aries and you want a family with your Aries. So we have, you are never old to start the new life that the time is now. Start planning. So some of you guys feel as though maybe you'll start planning on a Wednesday. Wednesday fell out. So you guys could feel as though that you're too old to start something new in your life. And that's not the case. Your ancestors and spirit guides would like you to get started on maybe a Wednesday. Now, any situation out here could happen on a Wednesday, but a Wednesday will be significant to you guys. All right, Aries, let's see. Who are you dealing with out here? Tell me more about who the Aries is dealing with. Someone could have red hair. So someone could have red hair. Grandparents could be significant. So someone could spend a lot of time with their grandparents or they need to spend a lot of time with their grandparents. We have Dodge SUV truck. So someone could drive a Dodge or an SUV or a truck or a SUV that's a Dodge or a truck. I don't know. We have social media, online dating sites. So you could be um, a person online 
or you met this Aries online or Aries, you will be meeting a person on a dating site. We have September, October, November, fall, autumn. So you could have met a person in the autumn within those months, September, October. Medium hair female. So some of you guys could have medium hair or you're dealing with a medium hair female. Someone could be short and thick out here. We have Cancer Pisces Scorpio. So you could be dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. We have... Someone needs to go to the dentist. They could have... Um, dental work that needs to be done they could have a missing tooth or some sort of teeth issues doesn't have to be missing teeth but some sort of um, teeth issues out here so regardless if it's you know getting veneers braces or anything like that or just a cleaning done someone needs to go to the dentist we have toyota honda nissan so some of you guys could drive that or you're dealing with a person that does We have contacts for vision or beauty. So someone could wear contacts for vision or beauty. Teacher, school student. So someone might meet uh, a teacher. You could be a single parent and you could find love at a school. This could be a teacher. You could be picking up your child at school and you could meet uh, a teacher or a parent that is at your child's school. Someone could have scary stalker tendencies. Someone could like uh, gambling. They're a big risk taker. They like to gamble or they're a big gamer. They like to game as well. Who are my Aries dealing with? Cheating on spouse to be with you. So there could be a person that is willing, Aries, to cheat on their spouse to be with you. So just be careful with that. We have Aries Leo Sagittarius. Could be dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius person. Always with friends. So an Aries Leo Sagittarius person could always be with friends. Or Aries, you are always hanging out with your friends. Tuesday could be significant. So Tuesday and Wednesday... Will hurt you, cheat, okay? So if you're dealing with a fire sign, a fire sign could hurt you, they could lie, they could cheat, they could steal from you, they could use you for something. Someone's still married out here. We do have person wants to marry you to use you somehow, Aries, so be careful with that. A coworker, so there could be a coworker that you guys are dealing with at work. A co-worker could lie. They could either eat, um, cheat their way to get it, whatever they want. We have transgender out here. So you guys could be dealing with a co-worker that's transgender. Maybe you will find this out about a co-worker. Maybe on a Sunday will be significant to you guys. We have someone is a little bit chubby on the chubby side. We have avoids all conflicts, someone who avoids all conflicts, or Aries, you are. That was a blank card, so I'm not going to take it. Works outside, hard worker, mill construction. Okay, so you could be, you guys could work outside, you could work in a mill, you could do some sort of construction, or you're dealing with a person that does, a fire sign wants to come out again, so... I didn't take it because it didn't flip and drop out, but you guys definitely heavy on the water, heavy on the fire sign. Aries Leo Sagittarius, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, you guys could be dealing with. So we have body tats, so body piercings or tattoos on this person you could be dealing with. This could resonate with someone. Uh, spies, gossips, and wants to be like you. So a person who has body piercings and tattoos, uh, could want, they could spy on you and they could speak with their hands. They could want to be just like you. They could, um, yeah, have tattoos, body piercings, but you'll know if that resonates with you because these will be significant on a person. 
Someone is trying to have some sort of fresh start. They could want to end up getting pregnant. Okay, so someone does want a family with you out here. Someone with a pointy nose. So someone could have a pointy nose. We have fresh start again. So someone definitely wants a fresh start. They want some sort of new opportunity with you. Someone could drive a yellow car or a yellow car will be significant. We have talented or has a talent. So someone is talented or they have a talent. Maybe a person who drives a yellow car that you guys will be dealing with or you already are dealing with. So an uncle can resonate with you guys. Something about an uncle. So a person could be close to their uncle or maybe, maybe Aries. Um, you're close to an uncle or this person you're dealing with is, or an uncle is an evil person in your life. Um, yeah, you could find out that your uncle is really, you know, an evil person. Maybe they're not a person you want to be dealing with. 1111 on the clock, as I said that. And with the evil person, that is negative forces that are trying to go against you. Your angels are working on your behalf, okay? So... For some of you. Now it could mean 1111 could also mean different things like twin flame and that type of thing. Uh, green eyes. So you could have green eyes, Aries, or you're dealing with a person that has green eyes. We have heartache, pain, sorrow, depression, cheated on. A person who has green eyes could be going through a lot of heartache and pain and sorrow in their life. They have depression because of the trauma someone put them through. We have medium hair male, so there could be a male that you're dealing with that has a bright smile. He could have medium hair. He could be tall as well. Aries. Who are my Aries dealing with? Sneaky, shady, lie, cheat, steal. Yeah, someone definitely wants to uh, marry you and use you guys for something. Um, so be careful in a commitment or wants one. We have Taurus energy out here. So there could be a Taurus that's, uh, committed already, or they want a commitment from you, but we have side piece. So they could be already in a commitment and they don't mind being the side piece or they, um, or they're putting you as like a side piece. Stuck on X, still thinking about the X. So someone, a Taurus could be still stuck on their X, but they're fooling around with you. Or maybe they want to fool around with you guys. But they're still stuck on their X. So they're coming in to you. They could come in to use you for that. This person could have long hair. Or maybe you guys have long hair. We have Thursday. So a Thursday could be significant to you guys as well. Black widow, male or female, with a black car, someone who acts and loves to travel. Someone could be a black widow or a male who acts like a black widow female who is, you know, um, yeah, so, so yeah, so someone could have a black car, someone tra travels for work, someone could definitely come in to use someone, um, they could... Definitely be sneaky, so you guys need to watch that. If any of these cards could resonate with you that I pulled, um, if you know, you know, you have green eyes and you have long hair and you're always in work clothes and you have light skin tone or something like that. So any of this could, you know, put it where it fits in your life. So someone is wide. Someone could be wide out here. So on the, you know, heavier side. A little bit which there's no problem with that we have secrets will be revealed bad energy will hold you back in bad magic so someone was doing magic on you guys they could be uh doing magic on you guys to you know set you back in life hold you back or try to get you to marry them so they can steal your money or something someone li lives or they're from a big city. They either live in a big city or they're from a big city. This could be a salesperson that you guys are dealing with out here. Any of this. Walking. You could like to walk. Or you could meet uh, someone as you're walking. 
You do got you guys have a gift of love coming out here. Some of you guys need a spiritual bath, so make sure you're taking your spiritual baths. We have fast food, so the salesperson could be in fast food. Um, you guys could be okay. So we have always checks out others, wandering eyes. So you could be dealing with a person that's always checking out others. They have a wandering eye, so be careful with that. Um, that could be your person, or that could be this person that's will put you in a side piece. We have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and Taurus energy out here so far. So walking, some of you guys take your dogs to the park or you're by a park or you could meet someone near a park as you're walking. Oh, we have destiny. So something is destined out here for you guys. Pregnant or wants to be. Yes, yeah, so she wants a family with you. So there's definitely someone out here that wants a family with you, Aries or Aries women. Um, you could want a family with someone and this is your energy. Yeah, you could want someone to be the father of your um, child. We have short and thin. So someone could be short and thin out here. <clears throat> Just want sex, one night stand. Okay, so you guys be careful with one night stand energy. If you're trying to meet people on online dating sites, um, be careful. You may, you know, meet a hit it and quit it type of person. So it'll be just like a one night stand. So be careful when it comes to that. Make sure you're setting healthy boundaries. You tell a person exactly what you're looking for. And, you know, if they have a person already with the side piece, um, yeah, so make sure you guys are telling and speaking up when it comes to what it is that you guys want out of a relationship. Some of you guys, you feel like you're too old to be pregnant. You're not. We have 40 to 45. So some of you guys could be that age and you could feel as though that like it's too late for you to have a kid, a child. You could, you could drive a red car or you're dealing with someone who drives a red car. We have brown hair out here. You could have brown hair or the person that you're thinking of has brown hair. Someone likes to cook out here as well. So you guys could be good cooks. You like to um, make sure that, you know, your food tastes very nice and people like your food. We have pills, drug, user, weed, heavy drug. So someone could definitely um, be a user out here. We do have drunk and then we have drugs. So there's something with a person that, um, and we have investigation. So be careful with that. There's a person out here that you may come across that is like this. Okay, so this person could drive a Lexus Kia or a Mini Cooper. We have fancy trends. This person likes to keep up with fancy trends. Or you're dealing with a person that does. Ooh, unplanned pregnancy. So a lot of pregnant energy is out here. So Aries, um, someone could be trying to get you pregnant or you're trying to get, you know, you want a family with someone and maybe, maybe some of you don't. And this happens, so be very careful if that's not what you're looking for. We have stuck, can't make a choice, um, blinded, not wanting to decide. Someone could have bad hygiene that has a beard. They're not, you know, they're not um, taking very good care of themselves. So some of you guys need to check on a grandparents. Okay, so we have Saturday. Yeah, somebody's a user out here. They want to use you for some sort of money. We have a mother, so a mother could be a user. <clears throat> Aries energy. In-laws. Okay, so a mother-in-law could be a user. Maybe you guys are trying to walk away from, you know, um, your in-laws. Maybe you guys... Uh, a mother-in-law wants your friendship that's a possibility too um, but there could be uh, in-laws that are trying to use someone for their money so 
be careful with your finances. We have age 45 to 50 out here. I believe I just called that, didn't I? I think I just called that. Yeah, 40, or no, that's 45 to 50. So you guys could be around this age range or you're dealing with a person who is. Some of you guys, this isn't going to resonate for you. Some of you guys, you know, maybe you just need to go check on your grandparents. And this is just your sign that, you know, maybe you haven't visited them in quite a while. And now it's, you know, that's a confirmation. You were just thinking about it and you need to go visit them. Okay. So like I said, it's not going to resonate with everyone. There's a female out here that has long hair, long hair again. So definitely a female who has long hair. We have a Friday, so a Friday could be significant to you guys. We have sports, plays, or watches. So you could be dealing with a person that likes to play sports or they like to watch sports. All right. So tell me more. What does my Aries need to know? What do the Aries needs to know? I know it's a mess on my table, but I'm trying to give you guys as many messages as I can. So we have, you are on the road to success. Okay, so Aries, you're on the road to success. And then we have wealth. Yeah, so definitely wealth is coming in for you guys. So if you feel a little lack in your money, maybe that's why there's a person out here trying to use you guys for your money. Because it does look like, you know, you guys are on your way to success with whatever it is that you're doing. Um, we have Leo energy, time to act, could be dealing with a Leo. I did say fire sign energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, someone could be sorrow over a loss. Okay, so there could be some sort of loss. Beware of self-delusion. Okay, so you guys need to beware of self-delusion. Time to get out of a situation. So some of you guys will be getting out of a situation, warning you of a problem either now or in the future. We have spiritual love. You guys will meet with, the, when it comes to this love right here, gift of love, it will be spiritual love. Okay, so you're going to end up meeting someone who's going to make you very, very happy. You will be playing a different role. Okay, so you guys will be playing a different role. If you feel stuck in life, it's not going to last forever. You'll be playing a different role soon. Maybe some of you guys are jumping out of relationships. And you guys are getting into something that, um, you know, will be beneficial for you. We have unsuccessful plans. So some of these people that are coming in to use you, they're, it's going to be unsuccessful. We have Ram energy. So Aries, that's you. You could be a stubborn or an aggressive person or one of these people out here is viewing you as being stubborn and aggressive, maybe because you're not giving up your finances like they want. We have spiritual Spiritual development, enlightenment, awareness, and understanding, okay? So you guys will definitely be um, getting into a love connection that will be spiritual. You guys are focused on your um, transformation. You're having an awakening, and you guys are being more enlightened to, you know, situations, things, people, and everything around you. You guys are having spiritual growth, okay? <clears throat> So we have chain of e chain of events that will affect your life. So if you guys are dealing with a person that is, I mean, be careful with one night stand energy because you could definitely get pregnant. Okay, with that unplanned pregnancy out here and th that could, you know, affect your life. You guys could end up getting pregnant in April. Um, we have boot, increase your effort if you want to achieve your goals. So you guys need to increase um, your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. So if you're like kind of lacking a little bit, just put more, a little bit more effort into it. Position of authority. So you could have be a position of authority. You could be in this, you could be some sort of authoritative fig figure in your life where you're going to be dealing with... Um, a person who is um, maybe this investigation energy, either a person that you're dealing with or you will be dealing with 
they could be dealing with, you know, that situation as well. Or Aries, this is you. You guys take what fits and leaves, leave the rest. Pleasure with a close friend. So some of you guys will be out and about having pleasure with a close friend. Um, <clears throat> be careful with doing business with any friends at this time because I do see that <clears throat> you can have a shady friend. All right. They could try to use you for money as well. All right, so we did have co-worker out here. So definitely watch. If you're trying to do any business with any friends or they're trying to come in and, you know, convince you to do business with them, don't do any sort of business, you know, anything like that. So we have peace and harmony is going to come to you guys. So, yes, you're definitely going to get peace and harmony with whatever's been on your mind, with what's ever been, you know, what's with whatever has been bothering you guys. Uh, you guys could be dealing with a depression, anxiety, worry that someone is against you. You could have this be in this energy, be sitting in this energy right now. And, you know, just don't worry about it. Peace and harmony will be with you, okay? So let me grab this other part of the deck. It's too big. It's a lot of cards to hold on to and shuffle. And I never, ever, ever just pull random cards out of my decks. I was told not to do that, and I will not ever do that. Whatever flips out is meant for you guys to hear. So uh, you guys need to time to go out and have some fun. So if you've been stressed out, you guys need to come go out and have some fun. Okay, so definitely go out and have some fun. You'll be happier if you do. We have August, so you could be dealing with a Leo that was um, born in August, August birthday, or something significant will be happening to you in August, or you can make some sort of vacation. Be show Okay, so you guys will be showing the way. Something you're dealing with um, has to do with August, but you'll be showing the way when it comes to either a person. This could be a Leo, like I said, or a Virgo, a Leo, Virgo Cusper that you guys could be dealing with. And you'll be showing the way regarding um, this person. We have heart, heartache over what lo you no longer have. All right, so maybe there's some sort of heartache and pain that you guys, you know, you could be separating with your person then. But you guys will be showing the way. I'm not taking all those that just dropped on my floor. It's too many. So, all right, we have lightning. Control your anger or you will be sorry. Victory in some. You guys will have victory in uh, whatever it is that you guys are trying to do. Yeah, you guys had a lot of cards that flew out. I'm not going to take all those, though. That's way too many. I'm just going to leave them down there for now. All right, Aries, let's see what your angels want you guys to focus on when it comes to all of this. So when it comes, so Aries in the pregnancy. So that's what I want to focus on. Let's do Aries in that pregnancy. I want to know what that one night stand energy is so that you guys are prepared for that. All right, so you guys could end up getting pregnant if you think it's not possible. If you are an Aries and you are between those ages that I said and you think it's not possible for you guys to get pregnant, it is. So let's see. So Aries in the one night stand. Someone could leave you because um, they're struggling to work. They're struggling with their self-worth. So they could, you know, be in that... You know, one night stand in energy because they feel as though they're not good enough. Yeah, they, they, they feel as though they're not good enough in a connection. All right, so Aries with the unplanned pregnancy. Spirit, what do you want the Aries to know with the unplanned pregnancy? Oh, this person is toxic. Okay, so they could have manipulated you. They could be a narcissist. Tell me more because what is, what is she saying? Oh, this person could have more than one love. Or you guys will need to make some sort of decision regarding your choice when it comes to your um, choice with having this child. It's going, like I said, it's going to be 
shocking news and yeah it's gonna surprise you because you guys are gonna think that you can't get pregnant at that age and you can yep you could want okay so if you're an aries that ends up getting pregnant it's going to be a shock to you you could be marrying your person um yeah you could be you thought that this would never happen like this was just like a physical thing only maybe this was you were trying to get to know someone flirting with them or you were just reconciling with them and you wanted to reconcile because this is a person from your past but you end up getting pregnant so yeah it's going to definitely be a shock to you guys okay yeah someone was missing someone from their past they were desiring a connection um someone could be behind bars or just about to get out or they did get out or they will be getting out and this does happen all right so yeah so we have this person will leave you in regret tell me what that's about so the person that will leave you in regret, you could be thinking that they will leave you in regret. You could have a lot of fear when it comes to this person, but someone needs forgiveness and this will be a blessing. So Aries, if you are this person that um, keeps thinking that there's a person that's going to leave you in regret, you're overthinking, okay? Um, you need forgiveness or this person needs forgiveness and this is going to be a blessing, all right? So you guys need to stop overthinking. What is this evil, crazy uncle? Okay, you could be dealing with a crazy, evil uncle. Who is this person? What is this person doing to my Aries? Crazy, evil uncle. Trust the signs. Um, crazy, evil uncle could not want you to be pregnant with whoever it is. Either this could be your crazy, evil uncle or... Um, your person's crazy e evil uncle, but someone could definitely trust the signs when it comes to this person because they could be, you know, trying to sabotage this. Yeah, they could be telling your person moving fast and telling your person that this is, you know, a, uh, you're a false twin flame. Okay, so they're trying, this person's trying to break you up with whoever it is you're dealing with. All right, so who is this cheating on spouse to be with you? Okay, so there could be a friend that is willing to, um, you could be friends with someone, Aries, and there's in your friend group, there could be a friend that's willing to cheat on their spouse to be with you. This could be a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius person in your friend group that is willing to cheat and be with you yeah they could be in some sort of separation but they're admiring you and they're definitely spying on you and they are trying to do some shadow work right now and they will be taking some action towards you maybe to say i love you and they're going to be putting the effort in all right, Aries, so yeah, you have a friend in a friend group that's willing to cheat on their spouse to be with you, and this could be a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius person that is trying to come in and do that. Okay, so yeah, that could be any of the description that I said. Uh, they could be, you know, look like that person this cheating on spouse to be with you so yeah there could be a person in your friend group that matches the description that i set out here i don't know so we have take back your power use your god-given powers and intentions to manifest blessings into your life yeah so aries there was also a person that was doing um magic on you okay uh, secrets will be revealed when it comes to this person you could find out that this uncle is you know manipulating your person um you guys need to have crystal clear intentions be clear about what it is that you desire okay and focus on that and only that we have gentleness 
Be very gentle with yourself at this time. Surround yourself with gentle people, situations, and environments. And we have outdoors. Go outside to get some fresh air and connect with nature to relieve stress and gain new creative ideas. I'm going to take one more and then I'm, I'm going to close this reading out. So we have sensitivity. You are extra sensitive to the energies and emotions right now. Honor yourself and your feelings. All right, Aries, that has been whatever comes out reading for you guys. If you resonated with this, drop a comment and don't forget to hit that like, like button for me. Thank you.